minute. Did you read the directions? No, I don't need any directions. Good morning. It's another day calming. We're getting close to being done with the outside. Yeah, and so we're up really early so that most of this is still in the shade. We're gonna try to get that coat on. That's kind of the plan for today, I think. Do you think we can get the whole thing done? This? Yeah. I think there's probably something else we might be able to get done too, but I don't know what that would be yet, so. It's a little windy. Sorry about it. It's just the way it is here in Arizona. Apparently, all the time. Yeah all the time until it gets to be 100 degrees then there'll be no then way. it stops of course yeah all right okay let's Enough talk we gotta sift before we can do before we bring the kids out we're gonna like do them a favor and do the worst part for them yeah i mean we can't make cob till we sift so yeah but we're gonna do it for the kids so okay. they don't have I, to. I see your angle i appreciate it we appreciate that <laughs> all right let's go okay Books and songs. I got to make you bitter The days are long But when your politics are bitter it's sure In days went on In God's considered Still the pretense on For you to feel bigger halfway done nice that's exciting yeah also <laughs> we were able to complete that much with a situation we had a we had a situation yeah some random dog came in through our fence well came up to the fence yeah and nine nine was like freaking out and so that dog started freaking out and got caught in the electric fence and ended up getting inside the fence yeah and that was a whole situation and then they were running circles around the cellar shed and it was like a cartoon <laughs> And so we finally got a hold of both of them, and we don't know who the dog belongs to. Well, we think we know. We think we know. I we, drove over there, but they have a gate. I can't get can't in there. Can't get a hold of them. So, so we're dog sitting. We are dog sitting for Which, a while. <laughs> we have stuff to do, guys. Yeah, we can't we be dog sitting other people's dogs. <laughs> Thankfully, the dog is super nice. Well, she's nice to people. She's really nice. She looks like she's trained pretty well, so she listens. Um, so she's just chilling out under the Airstream, staying cool. Um, 
and now we're gonna keep working on this you can see some of its already in the Sun but what we're gonna do is we're going to keep misting this wall and misting the cob that we put on so that it dries slow enough honestly with this wind today I think even the stuff in the shade is gonna be drying really fast so we're gonna get this scratch coat on call it done Dog situation. Still no owner. But she she's really friendly. Knows no boundaries. If she got along with 99, I wouldn't mind keeping her here, but they don't get along. guys we're gonna call it a night we didn't quite get done but it's nothing that we can't finish in the morning so we're just gonna go rest a little bit and we'll be back in the morning to finish it up Back at it today. Are you awake yet? No? Just trying to get this done before the sun is intense. But also we have to deliver baby goats this afternoon. 
So we're just trying to get done a little early today. Yeah. So what's the plan? What are we doing? We're just going to finish the outside cob. That's pretty finish big. Finish the outside cob. You should say that a little more excited. I can't. It's too early. <laughs> sad day here in the homestead. We have sold four of our baby goats. All four. So we're going to be down to three goats from seven. But we knew it was going to happen. It's just always a little sad to see him go. Especially Moose and Alfred. In a sea of flickering lights Playing tricks on your weary eyes What does it look like when it's real? Tell me what should I feel? How can anyone be sure just what love is? Let's 
Hey, thanks for getting that. You're welcome. <laughs> so, Jax, hmm. we're going to use this green stock for what? The rabbits for all their greens. And maybe a few things for us, but mostly rabbits. Uh -huh. Figured they like it, so. We could help supplement their feed. Uh huh. Give them a little more freshness to their meal. Yeah. Come on. What's that part? Pretty sure this is the bottom. Nope. Top. That's where the water goes. This one came with a wheelbase. A wheelbase. So we can rotate it so the sun can get on every side. Are we gonna use that? Or we can move it around. Are we gonna use that up here? Yep. yep. What's this part? Those go in between each tier, and that's what the water goes down and drips out of. Okay. Okay. Bunch of instructions, wheels. Now, you need to look at those wheels because three of them are locking and three of them are not. So you need to alternate them. Okay. okay. But I still need to... Okay, it is push on. No, they you should don't. have read the directions. No, they don't. They're yes, coming they off. No. Nope. Did, like, did, did, they, did, they no. really just... did you read the directions? Give me a minute. Did you read the directions? No, I don't need the directions. Because I got it. Ah, uh -huh. see? It'd be easier if you turned it over so you could just push them all on. Okay. I think it says that in the direction. I think they should click. I feel like if you had read the directions, maybe it would... Sit. You already know how it goes. No, I don't. Already... Mine doesn't have wheels. Maybe I should... Because there's nothing... Hang on. Just to make sure you can't, like, unscrew it and, like... The directions are right there. I don't know. Just so you know, the directions say... Use firm pressure to pop the wheels into place, alternating locking and non-locking wheels. Is that what you did? Yep. Good to go. They have been pushed in thoroughly. <laughs> all right, next step, Jax. What? We gotta get all the things to plant. We have some seeds and some plants that we've already started. Mm -hmm. Do we wanna put it all together first and then no. plant stuff? It says to plant it and then stack it. I know how to plant. So let's do that.
I want you to see this. Our first green stock, I did not get the rollers. And I wasn't sure if I would use it. I would totally use it. This is amazing. I can put it anywhere I want on the deck. This is awesome. I'm getting rollers. Can you go ahead and water it? Oh yeah, they're all, it's all, it's all going through. It's cool to see it here. So is that good? It's like one of those things. I'm totally getting rollers for mine. I'm it's jealous. It's so nicer, look. You want it over here? Done. Over well, here? be careful, because you don't want it to fall. Maybe okay. I want it over here. Maybe. I want it over here. It's got wheels. It can go anywhere. Not all terrain. Not sponsored. It is sponsored. It is sp sponsored. <laughs> Buy it. Just a little disclaimer here. Greenstock did send us this second green stock after we had purchased the first one, but I cannot recommend it more. And if you would like to go get your own green stock, just go to their website and enter the code tiny 10 for $10 off your purchase. I want to show you my creation. This is my spy box. Okay. Ow! <laughs> Hello. <laughs> so as you can see today, we had a very productive day. We are finally done with the scratch coat on the outside of the building. Which is huge. Very big. Like, we got windows in last time, and now we got the scratch coat done. It looks like a whole different building from the outside. Yeah. It's like when it's we look at it, we just can't, we're like, did we do that? Because I don't, it doesn't look like we did that. <laughs> yeah. So the next big step is going to be getting the buttresses covered with an overhang that's going to come out of the lintel that's above our front door. Right. And hopefully that happens this week. Yeah. And that will be the last sort of step before we move inside. I have a lot of people that keep asking us, well, what's going to happen when it rains on this cob outside? Are you not going to protect it? Yes, we will. Later. Later. But so for us in our situation right now, it's we've decided that it makes more sense for us to get to the inside and get the inside finished as quickly as possible so that we can set up the whole power system with the inverter and the batteries and solar panels. And then we'll come back to the outside later. Yeah. And so, yes, we might have a monsoon and some of the cob might get washed off or That's we okay. might get some little weird indentions in the wall. That's okay. We're going to come back and do all those final coats. <laughs> nine nine's trying to eat the wall. Nine nine. Nine nine. <laughs> Stop. It's fine. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to come back and finish that later, and we're just going to take the hit if we need to redo a few little parts here and there. Yeah. But for the most part, like, it's really solid. You know, the wind's not going to blow it off or anything yeah. like that. But yeah, that's the plan. So when we say when the we outside is done, <laughs> it's not done. It's not done. It's done for now. The scratch coat is done. Yeah. And we will come back and we will seal it up probably at the end of the project. Yep. Because, you know, the weather here is just really dry and really uneventful other than wind and it should be fine it could change in the summer we might get monsoons again yeah and we might not it's hard to tell <laughs> anyway that is it for this week yeah and we will see you next time